of a clog maker's equipment, and the wood of beech, birch, and plane trees is another part. The oldest method of making wooden shoes or clogs is still being carried on at the Stirlingshire Works, and the actual tools have been in the same have been the same for generations. After the logs have been roughly shaped, they are piled up so that the air can dry out the wood. The first of three more knives is now being used, and very soon the sole of the clog, to say nothing of the heel, begins to take shape. Each knife is a simple but efficient tool made for the particular job, and with years of experience behind the operator, the wooden shoe progresses quickly from stage to stage. Nailing iron edges to the soles is the next process. Now the soles are ready for the leather uppers, which have been shaped and sewn. There are special clogs for workers in various industries, and a number of others for export. There's even a clog for playtime. It's worn by a tap dancer. And now for the last item in our playtime program, that popular variety and radio star, Eddie.